Mr. Liu. Thank you. Uh, Mr. Pompeo, on yes, January 7th, Iran's foreign minister told NPR's Mary Louise Kelly that following the Soleimani strike, Iran was going to get rid of all limits on the centrifuges uh, that Iran uses to enrich uranium. So let me put that into some context. Uh, as of last November, the IAEA said that Iran's stockpile had grown to over 800 pounds. But then after the Soleimani attacks, Iran told the world that stockpile has more than tripled to about 2,600 pounds. So my question to you is, does Iran have more enriched uranium now than when Donald Trump took office? Yes. Okay. I want to switch to coronavirus because it's not top may, of people's may, minds. May I just make sure I get that? No, that's fine. Yes, they it's good. More, they, they have enriched to a higher level right. than they did when we, when we took office. That's a true statement. The, the maximum, it's, it's a little more complicated. I just wanted uh, to be more thank precise. You. So um, I'm going to switch to their coronavirus, which is top of people's minds. Donald Trump's chief of staff, Mick Mulvaney, told the Conservative Political Action Conference that the coronavirus was a hoax of the day. Uh, do you agree with Donald Trump's chief of staff, Mulvaney, that the coronavirus uh, is the hoax of the day? The State Department is doing everything it can to protect American citizens you, around the do world. Do you believe coronavirus? I, I'm not going to comment day. on what so others you say. You, you, I'm I, just asking you. Do you believe I, the I'm coronavirus telling, is a I'm hoax? I'm just telling you what the Secretary of State is right, doing. Do you believe the coronavirus is a hoax? We're working to keep people safe. Right, you can't even answer that question. Yeah, it's I mean, a very. It's not even look, a gotcha you're, question. You're, you're, do you believe the coronavirus is a hoax? It's a gotcha moment. It's not useful. Take, is take a coronavirus a, the a hoax? Can you just answer that question? We're, we're taking it seriously. This is a, this is a, right. this is are you, a serious. At 12.15 today, are you, in fact, yourself president. speaking at CPAC? The, the, at 12.15 yeah. today, are you speaking yes, at CPAC? Yes, I am. I'm planning. All right. So you can only give two hours to this bipartisan group of members of Congress. And instead of answering questions on life and death issues from a bipartisan group of America's representatives, you're going to go talk to a special interest group. Yes. You, sir, represent all Americans, not a special interest and group. I it speak. is shameful. You can't even answer basic questions. I Gentlemen's time.